The entire cinema world woke up to the most saddening news of legendary filmmaker K Vishwanathan's demise. But did you know that he died on the same day that his most celebrated film Shangara Bharanam released? Soon after this news about his death came, everyone is just stunned before his significance. It was on February 2, 1980, his film Shangara Bharanam was released in theaters and he died on February 2, 2023. Several Telugu stars including SS Rajamouli, music director MM Keeravani, actor Chiranjeevi and others paid their last respect at his funeral. He was 92. He was undergoing treatment for age related health issues at a private hospital in Hyderabad. His last rite rituals are being held in Hyderabad. Superstar Chiranjeevi was seen offering prayers and paid his last respect to the late Dada Saheb Phalke awardee. Vishwanathan, he started his professional life as an audiographer. His filmmaking career began under director Adurthi Subbarao. After a brief stint as a sound engineer and he later went on to work as an assistant director for the Telugu film Padala Bhairavi in 1951. With the 1965 movie Atma Gauravam, Vishwanath made his directorial debut and went on to win the state Nandi award. Following it, the director released Chellili Kapuram, O Sita Kada, Jeevana Jyothi and Sharada. Additionally, he appeared in over 20 films from Tamil and Telugu film industries. He made his Bollywood debut with 1979 film Sargam which is a remake of 1976 Siri Siri Muva. Some of his other popular Hindi films include Kamchor, Shubhkamana, Jaguda Insaan, Sanjog, Ishwar and Dhanwan. He was honored with Padma Shri in 1992 and the Dada Saheb Phalke in 2017. Over the course of a career spanning over 4 decades, he had won the Film Fair Awards 8 times and also won many cinema lovers hearts and still inspiring deepest condolences news desk kaumudi global